President of the Russian Federation, my dear friend, President Putin, Excellencies, participants of the Eastern Economic Forum, Namaskar. I am delighted to address the Eastern Economic Forum and thank President Putin for this honor. Friends, in Indian history and civilization, the word Sangam has a special meaning. It means confluence or coming together of rivers, people or ideas. In my view, Vardi Vostok is truly a Sangam of Eurasia and the Pacific. I applaud President Putin's vision for the development of the Russian Far East. India will be a reliable partner for Russia in realizing this vision. In 2019, when I had visited Valdivostok to attend the forum, I had announced India's commitment to an act Far East policy. This policy is an important part of our special and privileged strategic partnership with Russia. Excellency, President Putin, I remember our detailed conversation during the boat ride from Valdivostok to Jvelda during my visit in 2019. You had shown me the modern shipbuilding facility at Jvelda and had expressed the hope that India would participate in this great enterprise. Today, I am delighted that one of India's biggest shipyards, Mazgaon Docks Limited, will partner with Zvezda for construction of some of the most important commercial ships in the world. India and Russia are partners in space exploration through the Gaganyan program. India and Russia will also be partner in opening up the Northern Sea route for international trade and commerce. Friend, the friendship between India and Russia has stood the test of time. Most recently, it was seen in our robust cooperation during the COVID-19 pandemic, including in the area of vaccines. The pandemic has highlighted the importance of the health and pharma sectors in our bilateral cooperation. Energy is another major pillar of our strategic partnership. India-Russia energy partnership can help bring stability to the global energy markets. My Minister of Petroleum and Natural Gas, Mr. Hardeep Puri, is in Valdivostok to represent India at this forum. Indian workers are participating in major gas projects in the Amur region. From Yamal to Valdivostok and onward to Chennai, we envisage an energy and trade bridge. I'm happy that the Chennai Valdivostok Maritime Corridor is making headway. This connectivity project along with the International North-South Corridor will bring India and Russia physically closer to each other. Despite the pandemic, related restrictions, there has been good progress in strengthening our business links in many areas. These include long-term supply of coking coal to the Indian steel industry. 
we are also exploring new opportunities in agro industry ceramics strategic and rare earth minerals and diamonds i am happy that diamond industry representatives from shakha yakutia and gujarat are having a separate interaction as part of this forum i am confident that the 1 billion dollar soft credit line announced in 2019 will create many business opportunities between both countries it is also useful to bring together the most important stakeholders regions of the russian far east and relevant states in india on the same platform we should take forward the useful discussion that took place during the visit of chief minister of key indian state in 2019 i would like to extend an invitation for the governors of 11 region of the russian far east to visit india at the earliest friends as i said at this forum in 2019 indian talent has contributed to the development of many resource rich region of the world india has a talented and dedicated workforce while the far east is rich in resources so there is a tremendous scope for indian workforce to contribute to the development of the russian far east the far eastern federal university which is where this forum is being held is home to a growing number of students from india excellency president putin i thank you again for giving me this opportunity to speak at this forum we have always been a great friend of india and under your guidance our strategic partnership continues to grow from strength to strength i wish all participants at the eastern economic forum every success spasiba thank you thank you very much